To install Game Dev Assistant, we first of all want to go to the Game Dev Assistant website and log in. Now, once you have successfully gained access, you should be on your profile. Here, we simply want to go down to the Download Plugin section and click on the Download button. Now, do make sure that the version of Godot you have installed does match the required version listed here. Okay, um, so we're going to click download and that right there is going to download a zip file. Also note that if you are upgrading your Game Dev Assistant plugin, you can simply go down to the plugin upgrade instructions and follow these right here. All right, now inside of the zip file we downloaded, we'll have a folder called Game Dev Assistance. And this right here is our plugin. Now, what we need to do is basically extract the contents of the zip file to our computer. So if you're on Windows, you can do that by just right clicking inside of the zip file and then going down to extract all. Then we'll have this little pop-up window appear where we can choose the location to extract it to. I'm just going to extract it to my downloads folder and click extract. Okay, so now in my downloads folder, I have the extracted folder right here, and inside we have the Game Dev Assistant plugin. Now, before we import it into Godot, we first of all have to go over to our Godot project um, and make sure we have one thing set up, and that is our add-ons folder. Now, if you already have plugins in your project, you may already have this folder, but if you do not, we are going to go ahead, right-click on our root folder, and go Create New Folder. And we are going to create a folder called add-ons, A-D-D-O-N-S, okay? And make sure it is spelled exactly like this because add-ons is a folder that Godot is going to specifically search for in order to locate our plugins, okay? So now that we have that folder created inside of our root directory, what we can do is select the add-ons folder, open up our downloads where we have the game dev assistant uh, folder. Now make sure what we are doing is dragging in the game dev assistant folder, which has all of this stuff inside of it. So we are simply going to drag this folder into the file system and that is going to import our plugin. Okay. Now if we open up the add-ons folder, you should see we have game dev assistant inside of that. And inside of game dev assistant, we have all of the folders for the plugin. Okay. And down here, make sure you have the plugin.gd and plugin.cfg. Okay. As these are what basically um, help set up the plugin and initialize it. Okay. So make sure that your structure for your plugin looks similar to this. We have the root folder, add-ons, and then game dev assistant but it is not yet activated. What we need to do is go up to project, project settings, and then inside of project settings, we want to go up to where we have plugins. Now, here is where we have a list of all the plugins in our uh, editor currently, and we simply want to enable game dev assistance like so. Okay, we'll have the welcome prompt appear here with a little bit of a getting started tutorial. We're simply gonna click close, then we're gonna close out of our project settings. Now, where is the assistant window? Well, it is over here on the right hand side. Now, you might not be able to see it because your inspector window might be too uh, not wide enough. So we can click on these little arrows at the top to navigate over to the assistant panel, or we can simply drag it across um, to see all of the buttons here. Now, if it is your first time installing um, the Assistant plugin, then you'll be prompted to enter in your token. Now, your token can be found over on your profile, okay? You'll have your token here. You can simply click then on the copy button to copy that to your clipboard. Then back inside of Godot, we can go here and paste our token in. Now, if you want to hide your token from view, you can simply toggle the hide token uh, toggle right here. And then once that has been completed, you want to click save. Now, once your token has been validated, you can click on the plus at the top left corner to start a new conversation and begin using Game Dev Assistant inside of Godot.